Hello, I'm Frank McLaughlin from McLaughlin Lofts. Today is uh, December 10th, 2022, and many of us are getting ready to breed, and some have already started breeding pigeons. I just wanted to let you know what I do before I breed the birds, or what leads up to breeding. Uh, usually, about three weeks to a month before, I'll vaccinate the pigeons with a PMV salmonella combination. I feel that the fresh antibodies in the pigeons will be given to the babies in both the egg and the milk. So by vaccinating the breeders before that, you're actually passing more immunity on to the babies. Um, again, through the milk and through the egg, which is very helpful. I'll also worm the birds. I use moxidectin in the form of Quest. It's a horse wormer. I buy it at Tractor Supply. I usually make about um, seven gallons of water with one tube of Quest. I whip it up in the blender and I add it to the water. I leave it for at least 48 hours. I'll do that twice, maybe two weeks apart before breeding. I also spray the birds with a, a permethrin uh, for parasites. It usually lasts about a month. And then once they're clear, they'll be clear for quite some time. Um, two weeks before I'm going to pair the pigeons, I set the lights. I run the lights 24 hours a day and it stimulates the pigeons. They think it's summer or at least, you know, late spring. The hormones get going. They're ready to breed. They'll actually, almost overnight, they'll start losing body weight. Once the hormones start pumping in both the cocks and the hens, they reduce their body weight. So I'm not worried about fat pigeons going into breeding. Usually with the lights on for two weeks, the birds will drop weight. It's pretty amazing how quickly they drop weight once the lights go on. They actually literally eat much, much less once the lights go on. And again, even though it's winter, they think it's summer. Uh, the other thing I do is I make sure they have all the possible rich grains and minerals in front of them. I use uh, Versalaga Champion mixed with energy. I use rabbit pellets, I give that a couple times a week. I have a feeder of chicken pellets and every mineral imaginable. So I wanna make sure the birds are nutritionally complete. I hope you have some success and uh, I've been pretty lucky here at McLaughlin Lofts. If you like the video, you know, like the video, subscribe and I'll keep them coming. Thank you, Frank McLaughlin, McLaughlin Lofts.